Sorry, I'm gonna sip some water. Mm. Okay, so this is the thing about the concealer. I actually got it a shade too light. I just came back from Vegas, so I got super tanned. So what I'm gonna do, this is also like a little hack for you guys that now as summer is starting and we're all like tanning and you know, changing shades. If you currently don't have like a concealer in your um, makeup that matches you right now at the moment with your new color, you can always like, what I'm gonna do is, here's the concealer, I just put it on my hand. So I'm actually gonna mix it in with a little bit of the Say Tinted Moisturizer because that's gonna help to warm it up a little bit more. I'm just gonna do it with the same brush that um, I did the primer with, the highlighter. So I'm just gonna mix the two of them. There we go. That looks way better because otherwise that concealer would have looked crazy on me. So I hope that you guys like that tip. Love that glass. Oh, the cup. Thank you. It's from Target. It was only like $4. So, so good. Um, so this is the Kosas concealer. Um, I have actually used it before. I really like it. It has great coverage. I'm actually going to pull out my beauty blender just to blend it out. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. And just to brighten a little bit more on my face, I'm going to do a little bit here on my forehead just to kind of like balance it out. Sorry if you guys hear that siren in the background. It's like New York City. I'll wait. There's always going to be a siren passing by. Can't help it. Okay. Yeah, that looks good. So what I did is just that I added a little bit of the concealer also on my forehead and on my chin to kind of like balance out the face. You don't just want bright under eyes because then that looks a little bit off. If you also just do a little bit on the center of your forehead and on the chin, it helps to balance out your face. Oh, I know. It's like I need to get the right shade of concealer but honestly I don't mind doing this in the meantime because I feel like we can save money if we just like mix the concealer with our foundation just to make it a little bit warmer if you don't want to like you know buy something new okay now this step I know not everyone likes to uh, set their face with makeup but I honestly do especially my under eyes because they crease very, very fast. So I'm just gonna grab a little bit of my translucent setting powder. You guys could use whichever powder you have at home. I feel like we all have one because it's just such an essential. So I'm just gonna do some under my eyes to prevent creasing. That concealer works so well. Like, there we go. I'm also going to do some on my nose, chin, and the middle of the forehead. Basically, the T-zone. Just like that. And then on the side, I still have that radiance from the primer that I did. Well, the highlighter that I used as a primer. Still there on the side beautiful so now we are gonna go ahead and bronze bronzer is actually my favorite thing when it comes to makeup i don't know why i just i love bronzer so so much so little hack i love using um there we go so you guys can see it 